Leaders who use their communication skills to overcome chaos and restore order to their world are masters of disequilibrium. You may not know it by name, but you've either dealt it or felt it. Disequilibrium is a state of cognitive imbalance that occurs when we encounter new information that doesn't fit with our existing knowledge or understanding. It's like this, or this. It can be an uncomfortable feeling, but it's necessary for learning. If I were you, I'd want to know how can making an audience feel uncomfortable actually help me succeed? If you've ever learned anything that left you a little bit confused or scared or even freaked out, you've experienced disequilibrium and you learned something from it. Maybe you learned that something you thought was true was actually wrong. Or maybe you were introduced to a new idea and you didn't see that fitting in your world at all at first. If so, you've experienced disequilibrium in learning. We can't know what people are bringing to the table. What we do know is that people don't come with tabula rasa. There isn't an empty head. They all bring something. And in fact, they've all had to make some kind of decision about what reality is. And so everybody that's sitting at the table in your classroom or in your meeting has already made up their mind about something. And if you want to infuse new information and assimilate that with their prior knowledge, you have to cause some kind of destabilizing of that myelinated structure that's already in there. You see, when we experience disequilibrium, our brains are forced to work harder. All of the attention goes to that thing because it doesn't fit our thing and we either need to assimilate it, toss it out or run. And this is why our whole brain learner-centric framework is in such demand. Knowing how to govern instruments of learning like disequilibrium, elevate you and your learners, your staff, your clients and colleagues through deep understanding of any concept. Because when we offer something that's gonna cause them to um, suddenly begin to think differently about what they thought they knew, then there's an opportunity to add some new information. If there were no such thing as disequilibrium, magicians would be out of a job. Except today, the new magicians are neuroscientists who take this new information from the learning sciences and cognitive neuroscience and give people like you and me tools that we can wield in a learning environment to drive home deep understanding. Not memorization, but actually understanding how to put this new information into my world and make it work. When administering disequilibrium in the learning space, you have to be careful just like a master chef. You have to use the right amount at the right time. Just like cooking food, cooking learning in somebody else's brain requires a certain recipe. And that recipe is how the brain processes information now people love to learn. It's brain-centric. If you want to start cooking, check out the information below. Subscribe, sign up, let's have some fun. You've never been taught to think, only told to think. Think about that.